and welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with another StarCraft 2 commentary. My opponent for this match is Masses. Um, because she has, because there's a, a female picture here, I'm going to assume it is a female. So she is uh, ranked 28th in her Platinum League uh, with 396 points uh, with a record of 31 and 36. And here we are in the game. I am the Blue Terran in the Northeast up against masses uh she i'm gonna stick with she because there's a female picture so sorry if you're a dude and you have a female picture but i'm gonna assume that you're a she she is the red zerg in the northwest the map is shakura's plateau which automatically made me think holy crap what the hell am i gonna do how do i counter muta bailing zergling on this map uh because of course uh that first hatchery is pretty much gonna go down whether you like it or not there's not much you can do maybe i could send one of my initial S scvs out but still even then there's no guarantee that i'm gonna pick the right spot to scout um i do know i have noticed that there's there's never a, a vertical um a vertical set uh, uh for a two, for a 1v1 um when i go uh when you spawn on this map and don't go straight down i have never seen that done it is either across horizontally or across diagonally never never vertically uh just something to keep in mind but no she's going for it looks like a 12 pool i've never seen a 12 pool done before um and i don't know what to think of it really i mean it's it's not gonna work on this map um Fast Zerglings, maybe, but I mean, what are you what are you gonna do with with fast Zerglings on this map? So I go for the scouting here, and I find out where the base is, and I look in, and I'm like, what the hell? No, no hatchery. So I'm looking around, and I'm like, okay, where where is it? There it is. There's the spawning pool, and holy crap, it's almost done. And how come the drones to try to finish the, try to finish this SCV off? They will not. He escapes with two hits remaining. Um, another drone out. Looks like he's going to be going for something. And automatically, two spine crawlers going up in the middle of the the mineral line. So that SCV made her think ultra defensively. One of them gets canceled. One of them looks like it will finish. She did not cancel it. Gas is on the way. Um, no hatchery, though. Uh, meanwhile, I'm pretty much going for two racks right now. Um, reactor on the first barracks. Um, but really, I, I think that that early spawning pool scared me into my normal build more than anything else. Um, it didn't make me think... Um, holy crap, what am I going to do against Mutas and Banelings? It made me think, holy crap, what am I going to do against some early Zergling, Speedling rushes, uh, that early pool. So, really the counter to a, to a Zergling push like that would be three racks. So, that's, that's what I'm getting. So, uh, we're not going to be seeing a different strategy out of me, at least in the early game, for this Zergling, for this Zerg player on a map where I kept saying that I wanted to get a new strategy it just um, when I did the scouting it scared me into to what I'm familiar with which is three racks uh, bailing nest is on the way so we are gonna be seeing you know zergling banelings so I assume that mutas will be coming later on but right now it's just two zerglings I should have a lead in the, the army count and I do I do have three Marines out but I am playing defensively as well. That spine crawler could easily move out to here. But I, I can't say I know what's going on. Ah, I remember now, I remember. Uh, this player actually spawned as a random... Uh, this was a random player, if I remember correctly. And, and uh, this was... Um, this is what she spawned as. So maybe she's not as familiar with um, the the random classes, you know, with Zergling as she is with the other with Zerg as she is with the other one. So maybe that's it. I, I 
I'm about 80% sure that this was a random player. But I, I, I cannot be 100%. In comes the Overlord. Gonna do some good scouting. It looks like she, she was trying to make sure I didn't have the expansion. But of course she's gonna be... There we go. Overlord going out of the way before it dies due to massive marine attack. Second hatchery is on the way. It is completely completely late you know i've never heard of a 34 hatch i'm just saying i still have a huge lead in the army i've got nine marines four marines up against eight zerglings i could easily move in and completely wipe out whatever masses has uh but really i think i'm scared um I'm also doing a lot better job spending my resources you know 800 minerals 250 gas um, I, I don't know what is her hold up here unless, I, like I said, that she's random and just not familiar with Zerg. Um, that's why I don't play random. I, I, even if I spawned as Protoss, I, I don't think I could put up the same caliber game that I can as I am when I'm Terran. That's why I play as Terran. And of course, Zerg, I... I, I've mentioned this before, I, I absolutely suck at Zerg, and so you will probably never see me play a Zerg, uh, maybe a couple years down the line when I finally learn what the hell is going on with Zerg. Um, but really, this is, this is exactly the same problem that I have with Zerg player, when I play a Zerg. Um, I constantly inject. Um, I never get any creep tumors out, and creep is very important. I do go for the second hatch. I don't think of transferring drones. I don't think of transferring a queen. Overlord is down, so um, she will not. Masses will not be able to to make any more units. It looks like uh, we are seeing a few banelings on the way, and a spire is up. But of course, nothing will come of that, um, and it doesn't look like she has enough gas to get any large amount of mutas i only believe a couple uh will be able to come out because there's the mutas are very gas heavy so in comes the army the banelings able to take out almost everything i have and i still have the lead in the year's loss count just barely though uh because of course banelings do commit suicide interesting um, so, and even though there's a ton of room now in the supply count, uh, spine crawlers are on the way. I'm able to take out the hatchery here. Zerglings popping out along with the broodlings. That might be enough to 